of California is going to the polls tomorrow, the last-minute blitz to get out the voters in full swing tonight. Bill Clinton brought his campaign to Oakland today as he prepares to wrap up the Democratic Party nomination. Former California governor and presidential hopeful Jerry Brown says the L.A. riots underscore the need to pump more federal dollars into the inner cities. Channel 7's Lisa Stark reports from a Brown campaign rally in Oakland, where the candidate insisted he is still very much in the race. The music was loud, the crowd enthusiastic. Brown told supporters Clinton and Bush offer nothing but empty rhetoric. When it was time to bail out the SNLs, when it's time for foreign aid, they talk tens of billions. When it's time to invest in America's cities like Oakland and San Francisco and Los Angeles, it's crumb time. Polls in California show Brown trailing Clinton slightly, and a new national poll puts Ross Perot ahead of both Clinton and President Bush. Perot is the, is the reflection of the discontent that I called attention to six months ago. Brown insists he's still the best alternative candidate vote for my candidacy in this June 2nd primary, open up the Democratic Convention. If not, then buy a ticket on the Titanic and watch the party one more time sink into the deep blue. The candidate may not be willing to throw in the towel, but most of his supporters admit that Jerry Brown is a long shot. This sounds really cynical, but a vote for Jerry Brown is a vote of no confidence for everybody else. And that's what it's about. Maybe you can take in a position for change this time. For myself, the race isn't over until there's one person left standing in the ring. Brown's campaign continues to run on a shoestring. Today, volunteers passed the hat and signed up workers to help get out the vote. Staffers urged the crowd to go to the polls. Otherwise, they said, we will truly be singing the blues. In Oakland, Lisa Stark, Channel 7 News.